had a very exciting morning which included a dash to the house next door to get on the long range VHF because I heard somebody calling the radio and mine was not strong enough and then it, obviously it wasn't on the right channel because it switched to the Coast Guard channel and then the volume wasn't up and I'm like because <laughs> I ran anyway it's been exciting I've been up and ready to go since 7 30 this morning because everybody left at 7 30 or just after um, I'm going to hang out in the house for a little bit longer, I think, and then I'm going to head over to the store uh, because the internet is a little bit better there and the phone is in a better position. And I can get stuff done in the store and I can also work on some website stuff that I need to work on, including building some more content, creating some more content. You know, I've been calling myself a content creator for <laughs> like years now, ever since I quit my job in the city, and it really feels true. I don't know what's happening with my voice. <coughs> But overall, I'm feeling pretty good. Anyways, I'm gonna head downstairs. Should not leave the phone and radio unattended for too, too long. There is frost on everything. The dock is just covered in frost and I'm glad I haven't had to go down there yet. I know the lighting is terrible, I'm sorry. It's just, the sun's right behind me. I've just relocated to the store. I'm just going to let the dogs out. It is, <coughs> so cold right now. I mean, hence the frost on the ground, but it is so chilly. I'm I'm not enjoying it, <laughs> but it should be fine. But I mean, it's really pretty. You can't, you can't complain about this. Anyway, there are no adults on property. <laughs> adults. <laughs> um, and then we just have the one guest who's here. He'll probably be going to his island soon enough, but for now he's just chilling in his cabin with his dog. <laughs> oh, so yeah, I'm gonna go let the puppers out. Let's see how excited they are to get outside. I don't, I wouldn't be excited, but we'll see. Say anyone want outside? Hi, do you want outside? You're good? Good morning. Do you want to come outside? Do you want to go inside? Alright, so I have been at the store for a couple hours now. I think it's just after 11, so like two hours. Um, it's been kind of busy, not too bad. Um, just with phone calls and stuff and doing things and writing stuff. Uh, but Strudel's mom is back and she's here until I think like 2.30 or something. So I'm going to go back to the house because she can answer the phone a lot easier and she has a long range at her place. So we go back to the house, warm up a bit, because it's a little chilly in here, and, um, stuff. <laughs> I wrote a tour write-up, and I think it was pretty good. I, I think my favorite part, and I hate this, but it's good for marketing, but my favorite part is, at the end, it's like, with the ability to direct where you go or get off or hop on and off the boat at any point. It's not just an adventure, it's your adventure. And I hate that because it's so cheesy, but it works so well, so. Anyway, I think I hear a plane. I hope that's mail plane because then I straight up don't have to come out of the house again for a while. Also, what is, my hair is getting big? No, maybe it's okay. Um, but yeah, so I'm just packing up my stuff right now. I'm gonna buy some junk food because I'm feeling the junk food and, um, and just get on my way, I guess. Still a beautiful day, but it is so cold. Oh my goodness. Like, I brought a rain jacket because I thought it was gonna rain the whole time I was out here. I did not expect it to be this chilly. Also, I'm not in focus. Hello. There we go. Um, I don't have like a scarf or anything. I just was not prepared for it to be this cold, basically. But it's still, can I do this one handed? Every, I've got stuff everywhere. It's still quite beautiful. I'd like it so calm out there. So like I said, I'm headed back to the house now. I have to kind of keep an eye out for the mail plane because it's been sneaking in these last couple times and we haven't heard it on the other side of the property. So <coughs> hopefully I'll hear it. I'll we'll see maybe in a bit if um, Janice needs help because uh, Strudel's 
mom is around until just before three, so I'll have a little bit of time. But I think I'm gonna try to work on some more website stuff, maybe edit a video, and just like enjoy this. Yeah. On mail day, I always feel a little bit crazy because every time I hear a plane, I'm like, is that it? Is that it? I'm currently hearing a plane. Is that it? <laughs> Super annoying. I mean, the nice thing today is I don't have... Why are the dogs over here? Anyways, the nice thing today is I don't have any mail to go out, so I can just wander down at my leisure. Like, Strudel will wander over here when her mom's not around, but she's around. Ah, uh, there she goes, down the dog. Yeah, best laid plans. Immediately after I got back to the house, there was a phone call, and there was an extra charter at it, so... Away she goes. I'm really confused as to why Lucky's over near this side of the property though, because like she doesn't really wander. Anyway, so I'm listening. I don't think that's the mail play <laughs> for planes and watching, and I'm not gonna pack up and go back to the store just yet. I might in a bit, but we'll see. The plane! The plane has arrived! I was like listening and I was like, do I hear a plane again? But this time it's actually the plane. I can take a bit because she's got a taxi in still. Plane. Yeah, so I'm just gonna like, put my shoes on and go head down to meet her at the dock. I'm assuming it's the female pilot. She's usually here. All right, I need. What do I need? Radio, phone, shoes, toque, sunglasses. Ah! All right, mail plane is gone. There was so much mail today. It was like for, like I didn't have anything going out, and there was just so much coming in. So many packages. Anyway, the mail planes aren't just mail planes. They're also you can take flights on them. It's go on the mail plane tour along the coast, or historic, or I don't know what it's called exactly. So, she actually had a bunch of people on, I was right, it was a female pilot. She actually had a bunch of people on the plane, I think there was like maxed out five or six. And, it was a bird, it's not the seal. And every time new people come up here, they always want to know the history. So then you gotta like, oh, this is when the property was bought. This is what it was before. This is the order in which the buildings were built. Did you know the restaurant used to be in this building? It used to be on this building. Um, so I was like trying to go up with the mail. And so I just ended up sitting there for like the whole like five, ten minutes they were here. And talking all about Blind Channel because... That's what happens when you come, when, when people come here. It's, I don't even know how many times I've had the history of Blind Channel conversation with people. It's multiple times a day in the summer. Anyway, I'm back in now. I'm just waiting for Strudel's mom to get back. She should be here within like the next 20-ish minutes and then I'm gonna cook myself lunch because then she'll be around so I won't have to run or stop cooking midway through to answer the phone or whatever. So yeah, that's the plan. I broke my nail earlier, like it's really, it's right about here that it's broken. That's gonna be a problem. I'm, I'm hoping if I ignore it, it'll just fix itself and it'll grow out a bit before it decides to snap off because right now it was bleeding when it happened. Anyways, I'm rambling for no reason. I'm gonna get back to work. I've done all the invoicing um, up to date because I'm quick. And um, yeah, I guess website stuff. I know I'll never be her favorite, but I'm a close second because she sits here on the patio and she waits for me. Hi, sweetie. Oh, it is cold outside. Oh, you need some pets. You need some pets. Strudel got mail today. I mean, technically, it, it, it was for her, but obviously she didn't order it. It was a rain jacket. So days when it's very wet out because she loves being outside, when she comes back inside, her mom can just take the jacket off and then the house doesn't get cold. It's not to keep her dry, it's to keep the house dry. Up, shoot up, up, all the way, all the way, all the way. Oh, yes. Look at this, you are facing the wrong way though. Anyway, um, I've just been editing a vlog and I was doing some invoicing, answering some phone calls. Nothing overly exciting. Um, there's it's just me and Janice on property again because everybody else left. All the water taxis are gone. Our guest is still away. So yeah, good times. Anyway, um, I just I was about to update anyway, saying that I was editing a vlog, just to be like, yep, yeah, this is what I'm doing. Um, but then Strudel came by. Hi. <laughs> I love me a Strudel so much. Who's a good girl? 
anyway, um, I'm gonna get back in and get to work here in a couple, but I can't just not hug her. Oh, yes. Um, but yeah, that's where we're at. That's what we're doing. It's a beautiful day. It's, it's a bit brisk, but you know, it's, that's, I can't complain about looking out at this, to be honest. I never do. I always think I'm just so lucky that I get to work here and look at this. Like the store, the view from the store, it's stupid. Anyway, I've lost a strudel, so I'm gonna go um, inside where it's warmer. And also I need to pull my nails all of a sudden, and I think my cold is still kind of hanging on on the edges. Um, just not quite 100% better, and I think I mentioned the other day we were playing soccer. <laughs> And so I probably shouldn't have been outside in the cold running around, but it's fine. It was worth it. It was lots of fun. But yeah, I I feel like I've had a pretty productive day. It's been a nice amount of busy. Not too crazy, but not too dead. <laughs> yeah. All right, so I got another vlog edited, and I am back on the website right now. I have to do rewrite this Ocean Rapids tour. Uh, I rewrote it kind of already but I talked to Strudel's mom about it and she was like well it's not really like as it's not really very intense because they're ocean rapids not river rapids they're kind of cool they're like whirlpools and stuff but yeah so I need to rewrite it and she has ugh, this like remarkable experiences program uh workbook that she did with Destination BC and so she lent it to me and it's got ways to kind of do write-ups like that and so I did a write-up today I think I was talking about it earlier um and I kind of followed the principles because that was the first time I had it to do the write-ups and I really liked it so I'm gonna try to follow it for this one and then I might tweak the other write-ups that I already revamped uh to kind of follow that a little bit more but yeah it's um still a gorgeous day outside. It's been so nice lately. So cold, but so nice. I'm just chilling. Almost everybody's back. Our boss and his family still aren't back, and then our one other skipper. I don't see the island sprinter, so he is not back. But, um, yeah, it's, it's pretty chill. It's quiet right now. There's nobody else in the house. The skipper that's living in the cubby hole, basically, is moving back to the other house today. Uh, so that should be good, although there's like a sinkhole happening near the house, which needs to be fixed. <laughs> it's, they think it's like an old historic septic system, because it doesn't reek, but it's, Strudel's mom was checking it out and she almost fell in the hole, and my boss apparently almost fell in the hole too, so yeah, they need to resolve that at some point. But, it'll happen when it happens, I'm gonna keep working here, it is... It's 5.30. I'm probably not going to work for much longer because last night I was working on my computer till like 9 or 9.30 at least on spreadsheets and I don't want to do that today. In fact, very shortly here, I think I'm going to change my pajama pants. Yeah. Alrighty, it is just after 10. Uh, the skipper that was living in the house with us moved up to the back house now because... There's nobody, or not the back house, the round house, because there's nobody staying there, and it's just obviously more comfortable than the air mattress in the cubby he was sleeping on. And, um, so Jazz and I watch Survivor, and I'm gonna go to sleep now, because I'm tired. I've been on the computer all day between doing stuff for the business and doing stuff for me. Um, I feel like I had a pretty productive day. I'm caught up on vlogs to the 7th, and today is the... Ninth, yeah, today's the ninth. Um, we figured out plans for my departure tomorrow. Like, it was looking like I was gonna have to go in Friday morning and go straight to work, but that's not the case now, so that's nice. But yeah, with that, I think I'm uh, gonna go to sleep, so I'm gonna end the vlog here. I noticed while I was editing that there were two vlogs that I just didn't end. <laughs> Terrible, anyway. So, with that, I'm going to say thank you so much for coming along on today's adventure. I'll see you tomorrow when we do very similar things. And I go home. <laughs> Good night.